Yes, Hanato Moicano just defeated Benoit Saint Denis, and this was spectacular. He just submitted Benoit Saint Denis, and everyone's saying Saint Denis trash. He's not that good, and everyone's praising Moicano, but there's more people out there just shitting on Saint Denis for being absolutely mid as a fighter. And but Moicano should get the credit. He just submitted Benoit Saint Denis in the grappling, took the back, and got it done in Paris, and shot on the crowd. He shot in the crowd after a bit. And he also called out Paddy Pimlet. Maybe that's the fight we're going to see next. Realistically, though, come back to this fucking video when, when, when Bunny Moicano submits Benoit St. Denis. Come back to this video. Now, this is a big risk. Because what if St. Denis just randomly catches him and it's over? But this is a risk I got to take. Now, shout out to Kenny Okoye for this idea. All right. It's a shout out. I'm shouting him out. So you can't. You cannot say I'm copying Kenny Okoye in this sense. This is a one time thing. Maybe I'll do it in the near future, but probably not. But everyone keeps overhyping Saint Denis, and everyone's going against Moicano for beating Jalen Turner and Drew Dober and Brad Rodell back to back to back at fucking lightweight after originally losing to Fiziev in his fight there. People gotta look at Moicano as a real threat in this division. This guy's a top. This guy was a former top five uh, featherweight. If he'd beaten Aldo, he would have had a title shot against Holloway or Volk. Like I don't think that. I think that needs to be mentioned. He would have had a title shot against Max because Max was a champ then. If he'd beaten Aldo, at that time, Jose Aldo. Versus Moicano when that was happening. Benoit was making his, not UFC debut, professional MMA debut. I think people are looking at the fact that he looked so good in round one against Poirier. And that he's, big, he's, more, cycling, he's a more bigger name than Moicano as of right now. Because he's been in the big spotlights. He's been on main card of pay-per-views. Moicano was in the apex against Strudober. Was on UFC 300 against Turner, I will understand. But it was like a forgettable type fight. Because that card was insane, UFC 300. But everyone just saw. Everyone just saw. I thought Tom Moicano just win this. He just won. He, you know, he, maybe he, he didn't get dropped. Let's just say that. Round one, he got hurt badly. But he got the takedown to the end of the round. He survived the round. Satan and he dropped him bad. Moicano survived it. it ha and he survived it. In round two... St. Denis, he's already slowing down. Broken. It's in Paris. Making weird, like, anthems. Oh, like, you know, whatever the Paris anthem is. The pressure's getting to him. He needs to win this. Everyone's been hyping him up to be some fucking future champion, even though he's not. But, um... I don't know why people are picking St. Denis. Like, so, like... Like, I get when Connor's a bit chinny. I know I'm, I'm trying to make this like seem like we kind of, you know, won already, but he did. Come back to this video when we kind of wins. <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't care. I'm risking it. I really couldn't give a fuck. But still. St. Denis, I don't know why people picked him in the build up here. He just lost and people are shitty on him now when they should have. Uh, uh, they should have after the Poirier fight. Staff infection against Poirier, though. I don't give a fuck. Is not Makachev had staff infection against Poirier, and guess what? He pushed through like a champion. He did, I didn't see Makachev get knocked out in the first two rounds by but, uh, by Poirier. He won him. He won by fifth round submission win. Round five submission win with a Darce choke, energy based submission. That's how he, and he won the fight. I didn't see Benoit submit. That was a five-rounder against Poirier as well. I didn't see Benoit get a round five submission against, what's his name, Poirier. So the staff doesn't mean anything. Marab beat O'Malley in a five-rounder. He was fine afterwards. He had staff infection. So that's not an excuse anymore. I'm sorry. And uh, people finally realized, because Moicano just beat him. Just beat him. You know, just showed him that there's levels and experience to this shit. 
You don't just uh, lose to Poirier and then fight Moicano. Like you're going to beat him or something. <laughs> Good performance from Renato Moicano. He went out there and showed that there's just levels to this. You don't just... Yeah, you can get like a fluky head kick KO over Matt Hervola. And I say fluky because Matt Hervola decided to lose that night. And just run away from Benoit after a clinch exchange. Moicano isn't going to do that. Matt Favola ran away from a clinch exchange. Literally, they were in the clinch, and Matt Favola literally just ran away. So I'd walk on with head kick. Moicano ain't going to run away in this fight. He wants money. He cannot afford to lose in this fight. And he went out there and did... He should show, like, I've been watching any, like... You can maybe hurt me in the early round, but I'm, I'm going to stay in there. If Drew Ober can't KO this guy, if Jalen Turner can't KO this guy... Because let's be honest, Jalen Turner, yeah, he dropped him and fumbled to finish. But if Jalen Turner's so good, why did he do it again? And this time go for the finish? Because he couldn't. Because he was slowing down. When he kind of was putting pressure on him. Putting it on him. And that was that. So, I think everyone should just get off the board of Benoit saint I know Lucas Tracy's back on YouTube. He's picking Benoit saint And, um... Maybe that's it. Maybe Lucas Tracy really just hyped up St. Louis so much it put it's in people's minds now. And Lucas was gone for a bit and people were like, I'm picking Benoit, a.k.a. I miss Lucas Tracy. I do too. I'm happy he's back. I think he's only back for full card predictions though, which is, I, I, at least he's posting something, not just nothingness for so long. But I feel like he's done that in a way. And I think people are going to look at look at this. And people are looking at this. Like, Moicano just got an impressive win in Paris. And, um, yeah, what a performance from Moicano. What a performance. What a performance. Him versus Pimlet could be next. If Pimlet fights Daryush in the meantime. If Pimlet's smart, he'll fight Daryush. It's an easy win. Stay active, beat Daryush, he'll be number seven in the rankings. Moicano will be you'll be above Moicano in the rankings and beat Daryush. But um this is what you do. And um sucks for Saint Denis. He lost again. Um he'll be back though. He'll be back. We said that we said that about Poirier. Well, in the Poirier fight. Oh, Saint Denis is gonna be back. Oh, well, he just lost again to Moicano, so good performance by Moicano by, by not to Moicano. We do him versus Paddy Pimblich. Paddy Pimblich. Money Moicano. Can't afford to lose. Good performance by Moicano. He got the job done. Yeah, submitted by SD. I should have... You should have... Just come back to this video. Realistically, come back to this video. When Moicano beats St. Denis. Because... Hey. I don't know if fucking... I... I, I there's only a few people that are picking Moicano. I don't know what the fucking hype is. I'm actually getting pissed a bit. What is the hype on St. Denis? Like, I don't understand. Why aren't people picking Moicano here? St. Denis does not have great stand-up. Like, he finished Gabriel Miranda. Moicano finished fucking Jalen Turner. There's different opponents here. Experience will win. Good stuff, Moicano. Like, subscribe. Thank you for watching. Well, not thank you for watching. Welcome. What, what else did I say? What did I say instead of that? I need to think of something quickly. Um, just come back to this video. When Moicano wins. Come back to this fucking video when Hanato Moicano beats the fuck out of Benoit and submits him with a rear naked choke in round three. With one minute left to go. I'll fucking put that in as well. I doubt that'll be correct, but like the one minute part, but imagine. Look at a genius. And I am a genius. Because he just won. Good stuff, Moicano. Like and subscribe.